Let me just tell oh, Mr. Ursay and the folks at home, I was one of the ones criticizing them, but I only said what many viewers were thinking. Well, I just, <laughs> I'm, I, I've always loved Jeff Saturday. Yes. You know, he's a man of character. He's a good man. Mm -hmm. um, I'm just so happy to see his success, the team's success, to see Matt Ryan back out there. Yeah. And I think you said it best after you watched the game. You tweeted, uh, well, that was fun. It was fun. Although that last drive, I'm I was a little, a little sick to my stomach. Yes. I kept yeah. sitting up. Rosie didn't want me to move. But, yeah. boy, you were just glued. To the but it, it wasn't just the fact that they won that helps, but it was a good game. It was a great we game. We saw different football than what we've been seeing the last several weeks. Right. That's the difference. Yeah, different offense. And, and you really saw like that team coming together, oh, that I, camaraderie. I loved seeing the shots up in the booth of, you know, the new play caller guy and yeah. they were all you know high-fiving and cheering each other on and and that you know works its way down you need to have your leaders happy and cheering each other on it makes everybody on the field the happy. new play caller guy <laughs> I don't know your name <laughs> yeah hello right. sir tweet yes. us your name but, but the <laughs> thing is Sean is, probably G knows uh, Jim Ursay gave Jeff Saturday the game football and he said you know you you earned this I know yeah. you'll cherish it and then Jeff Saturday said we want a football for everybody on this team because oh, this awesome. is a team effort. Yeah. That's, okay. that's the mindset. There's Take no, us, there's no I in team, Felicia. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> Take us to some there's weather, no, Angela. There's no but, but there's you no are our snow. star. You <laughs> are our star. There's no I in snow either, but oh, it's no. uh, coming first thing tomorrow Yikes. morning. Uh, very, yeah, very that's similar your, there's your to, eye. Yeah, <laughs> similar to Saturday. Uh, we're not forecasting <laughs> a, a lot, but the timing is tricky because we are forecasting it to start to fall during the morning drive. So if you can, uh, set your alarm clock a little early. Check with Chuck. Lindsay's going to have traffic. All of that gets underway sunrise at 4 a.m. And we'll be monitoring live Doppler 13 radar with the snow moving in uh, during that time frame of 4 to 7. Got you covered tomorrow morning. 42 degrees this afternoon. That's it. That's 10 colder than where we should be. We were also 10 colder on the low temperature. Sunset this evening should be a pretty good one. That happens at 530. Nice to see the sunshine today. And we still have a little bit out there before it heads down. 37 at Morris Reservoir. 39 Carmel. 37 Greensburg. That looks great. Uh, Bunker Hill looks fabulous too. Currently 37 degrees. Uh, no snow on live Doppler 13 radar. So we are clear and the roads are dry. Clear in 39 in Indianapolis, but I do want to expand the view on live Doppler 13 radar. All of this area highlighted in this purple color. These are counties under a winter weather advisory from the northern sections of Illinois through parts of Iowa all the way south and west toward the Kansas City area. That's where we're highlighting the potential for several inches of snow. This storm system getting going responsible for some heavy rain and yes, on the no colder side of this system, some snow. This is coming out of Wichita headed toward Kansas City and this is the storm that moves our way. Hour by hour timeline with future track 13. We're dry this evening, so we pick it up at 11 o'clock and we stop it at six o'clock tomorrow morning. This is the reason you're going to need to watch sunrise. We're going to be tracking some snow may mix with a little bit of rain the farther south you are, but the snow will continue to fall off and on through the morning drive. That's 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. We'll stop this at noon. Backside of this little disturbance may produce some additional snow showers tomorrow evening. That's 5 p.m. So we just want to make sure you're weather aware and prepared for some snow that will stick. Temperatures tomorrow uh, only in the middle and upper 30s late afternoon. More snow showers are possible on Wednesday. Definitely a winter feel in this forecast. Snow and a little bit of drizzle tomorrow again may cause some issues on the roads during the morning drive and the afternoon drive. And we've got snow showers around for Wednesday and Thursday. Just stick with us and then get ready. Winter feel, well, temperatures for lows go into the teens starting Friday morning.